Hi there, I'm Casey Gray, winner of three Duels to the Death and counting, and today I'm here to talk to you about Strixhaven, a syllabus of sorcery. When reading through the book Wizards of the Coast gave us, you probably found yourself thinking, why doesn't this school talk about classes? I know I did. Well, so did Mike Bernier, which is why you now have the opportunity to get all that material you dreamed of for a price so low it's basically free. For the low, low cost of $2, you get the content no Strixhaven game is complete without, from incubating owlbear eggs to learning about civil engineering that will help the world heat its homes without harmful hazards. For that alone, this book would be such a steal that the Thief subclass should get it as a starting item, but it also gives you a band of rivals to compete with from your very first year, and weaves them elegantly through the adventure. Every time the stakes are demolished because the book says a teacher will come save you if you lose the fight, your rivals step in instead. You're still not in any danger of character death, but now you face worse. Getting dunked on by the kids who think they're better than you. They can prove it numerically too, since this book adds in a scoring system between competing teams of students you'll find feels familiar. It rewards the group with the most points at the end of the year with some kind of prize. I didn't even need that part of the book, because I already know that for a group of players, literally nothing will be more important to them than winning this competition with their fellow students. A penalty of points is something that professors can impose for students who perform poorly or are caught breaking school rules, again adding stakes into scenes otherwise totally lacking in tension. After purchasing this book, I awarded 10 points to Silverquill for outstanding work on their class project, and yes, I did buy it. No sponsorship here, I just like this thing. 